Oh, it sounds like it's gonna be so much fun. I can't wait to hear all about it. Oh no. What? Gosh darn nabbit. Are we back? Are we back? Yes? Hello? <laughs> After you killed yourself, it vanished. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are we back? Okay, we're back. Good. All right, sweet. Sweet, 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 sweet. I'm sorry that it dropped. I have to have gone bed and woke it up tomorrow. Yes, that is... I agree with that, Magnus. Hmm. Miranda! I will agree. Next time I do a game that fits your aesthetics and style. Yay! I'm pretty flexible. Though my style is not, I guess. I was like, the stream is allergic to me. It's not allergic to you. Oh my gosh, Haku. I just saw, like... You're, it's a gift leader too, but now it just says you have you've given twenty five gift subs on this channel. That is insane. Yeah, you do. It says that you've given twenty five gift subs. Thank you so much, Haku. And Twitch says that I have zero viewers. You are lying, Twitch. Lies. Okay, now it says I have nine. Good. That is accurate. This is, this is me fighting for my position as the ultimate sub-sniper. <laughs> It'll change in time. Thank you! Oh my gosh, thank you, Matt. I'm really loving what Gina's doing with Exio. Do you guys have any ideas how to make Exio look more like a hologram? Because Exio is supposed to look pretty real, but also look like a hologram. So I'm trying. I'm like I've been putting like the like dots on the on her, but I don't know. Yeah, I was thinking bluish too, like maybe like doing like some bluish line art a little bit. Like mini lines. Yeah. Yeah, no problem. Ha 
half a phase on like the arm or leg fade out with some vertical lines cut or something. Hmm. Yeah. I can maybe make her transparent. It's a good idea. Could do some TV staticish horizontal lines. Yeah, okay. So like, kind of like, that type of thing. I mean, that's too much, but, and not quite what I'm going to go with, but yeah, okay. I like that. Ooh, oh, I'm glad you, I th I'm glad you like that. I was thinking of, yeah, making her, like, a little bit more bluish. Maybe cut out a few of the lines and make it see-through. Mm, mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. Bluish tint to the glitch area. So, like, kind of, like, just... Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot, actually. That's a good idea. Thank you! I'm thinking at 5.30, I would take a little bit longer of a break. The other one was just a bathroom break. Um, but I th I'm thinking at 5.30, we'd take just a little bit more of a break. Uh, Nico, I took two breaks this time. I hope you're proud of me. I like Cortana from Halo. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I can see that. That is a good reference. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I just need validation. That's all I need. Take care of your corporeal form. Exactly. Achievement unlocked. Self-care. <laughs> nice. I do not know what Cortana's story arc is like, so I hope not as well. And I don't, I, if it's sad, I don't think it's probably gonna be that.
sweat. Funnily enough, this is the first time I've ever drawn sweat on a character. And she's a hologram. It's a lot of it's a lot of interesting concepts today. Yeah, Exio can't die, other than, like, data corruption and things. Exio is part of the computer. AIs in the Halo universe basically have an expiration date by which they need to be shut down because their code will make them in them too human. Cortana was active for way too long and ended up doing really bad emo emotional and phys psychological trauma that caused her to become a galaxy ending threat. Oh dang. Gina made the point that Exio has backup, so she has her own backup character. Yep, pretty much. Exio will be around for the whole time. How should I do this gradient? Okay, this is an interesting gradient. Okay, that's an, that is an interesting gradient tool. So I like it. I feel like this could be turned into an animation. <laughs>
there we go. I think that's good. Oh man, that's a big... <laughs> yes. Yes. Nope, not that. Yes. He I'm really proud of this, guys. Oh, I'm so proud of this. This is looking good. This is looking good. I'm so excited. All right. Um, it is uh five thirty. I wanted to get this lighting done because I'm just really I was really excited about the lighting part of it, and I wasn't sure what tool to use. So, oh, I'm glad you guys think it's good. Fairy dust keeps rolling in. Cannot wait to trade more human children debris. Yes, give me your human children. Look at them lights! Yes! He. Gradient tools for anyone who um, wants to learn how to do lighting. Gradient tools are your best friend. They're amazing. Break time! Yes, it is break time. Um, that means please do not go anywhere. I will be back in like five minutes. Uh, go, you stretch, get a, grab a snack, get some more water. Um, I'm gonna boost the stream, go to the bathroom, um, probably grab a snack, and I will be right back. This is the time we're actually doing a real break. Yes, please get some hydration, don't go anywhere, we'll be right back, and I will finish, hopefully, doing some really nice lighting stuff for Ezio. For Ex- Ezio. Ezio, the different character. Ex- Exio. Mwah. I will be back in, like, five minutes, and we'll be streaming until, like, seven, so. It's gonna be a good time. Bye! I'll be right back.
everybody. Uh, I'm back. Uh, I'm back. I am back. Hello. Ah, uh, did some good stretches. I'm still stretching. Um, also, Jay Myers123, if you're still here, thank you so much for following! I hope you enjoyed what you saw. Space Etsy is a thing I didn't know I needed until just now. Oh my gosh. Assassin's Creed. That's a thing that we should play on stream. We should play Assassin's Creed. I love Assassin's Creed! I absolutely love... Thank you! Thank you for welcoming me back, guys! Um, I'm gonna do my spiel real quick since we just came back from break. Um, First, of, first off, uh, I have a Discord. If you guys are interested in hanging out with me and the chat when I am not streaming, please join my Discord. Um, here is the link. Yes, please join the Brigade Discord. Um, um, I would have... I just opened up commissions. Um, if you uh, like what you see on stream and would like to commission me to do art for you, uh, I have that go- I have the, uh, I have a form that you can fill out, and once you fill it out, I will get back to you and we can start, uh, drawing. It'd be really great. And I can start drawing your stuff, and I've got commissions, and it'll be awesome. Here is the link to that. Oh, uh, I also forgot to introduce myself. My name is Bree. I am a comic artist and illustrator. I uh, draw a comic called The Phoenix. Um, you can see it, uh, the graphing under here. You can also support me on coffee if you would like. Um, no, obviously, no need. Um, and what else? I don't know how to, so I have too many things going on. I, I need to like write down a spiel to memorize. I also am working on a board game called Elemental Spark. If you would like to learn more about that, you can, um, we are sh at Sheep Ablaze on Twitter, or you can uh, type in, I don't think that's the command. What is, what is my command? What is my command for me? What is my, what is my me command? Um, post. It is host. That is my spiel. I should probably make my spiel a little bit longer. Thank you guys for putting the links in chat. Yes, I also work on a thing. I work for, I work for the San Gennaro Co-op. I am an artist there. I do art for their uh, wonderful games. If you would like to purchase them, uh, please follow that uh, tiny URL link um, that Nightbot was just provided. There's no space. <laughs> Haku. Um, oh my gosh. Commissions, Discord, uh, support me on coffee, um, comic, it's on Webtoon, uh, Tapas, it's called The Phoenix, I do a lot of things, I work on a board game, so many cool things are cool, are happening. <laughs> I also have a Redbubble, if you guys are interested in, um, buying, I also just made a new uh, sticker in honor of Ren from Clear Skies. If you are interested, it'll be going up on my Redbubble after this stream. And yeah, I will call that my spiel for today. I'll do another one at the end. And I, Jay Wilson, thank you so much for hanging out. I saw that you had to leave to go eat dinner. That is completely valid. I will be eating dinner after this. Um, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your night. Bye. Uh, I had to leave after the break. I'm mainly using this as a homework companion, but my call time is at 6. Doing a great job. Everyone go read and look at her stuff. Aw. Thank you so much, Miranda. It was awesome to have you here. I am so glad that you are that you were able to stop by. Um, this will be going up on my Twitter if you want to see it. I will also just send a picture to you if you want to see the end of it, because you are wonderful. Mwah, I love you.
<laughs> my Discord is not super mate. It's not super high maintenance, so don't don't feel free to, um, feel free to pop in and out whenever you want. Yes, bye bread. I'm not gonna tell you a funny tidbit, because my boyfriend can't tell you, because he's not in chat right now, and he can't tell you the funny tidbit to make fun of me. Haha. <laughs> suck it, Daniel. You won't watch this, but suck it. Mwah. I hope you're having a good time at school. All of the hearts. I just christened your gallery room. Yay! Thank you! Alright. Shall we get back to this? I think we should. I want to see what you christened my gallery room with. Oh! Those are- that is awesome! Those are really nice, Basilisk. Those are nice. I'm very happy. We will see how this goes. <laughs> Yes, you are always welcome to be in my Discord whenever you would like, Basilisk. I've also been intending to create life in your Discord. Thank you so much! Uh, I will respond. I've seen you guys put some stuff in during stream, and I will respond afterwards, because I can only do so many things at once. No, like it I mean it looks like a spotlight for sure. Should I just like get rid of the circle on the ground? Hmm. 
No. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> My creative juices are officially empty again for today, but I've finished six out of nine of the Chambers of Hell. Oh my gosh! Yay! I'm so excited to read about it. I am honestly so excited. I know I'm missing a lot of chats. I'm sorry. stream go to the gradient layer and move, remove the bit beneath the circle how do I remove okay oh that's true maybe it that's a good idea let me let me see if I can It's me, I'm okay. I did streaming the other night and it was very fun. Yay! I'm so glad you had fun streaming. That's awesome. Welcome to the stream, Fofos. Only three to go. Yay! I'm so excited for the Chambers of Hell, Miko. It's gonna be so awesome. Uh, put in some of your creative juices. <laughs> I've got four more aliens to do for this game to start with, and then this next one is, crystal is a crystalline creature, so we'll see how, to I, how I do with that. That is awesome. I love crystalline creatures. That sounds absolutely, like, so much fun. Um, I saw an Ifro's post about crystals. Ooh, yes. I'm really excited to see what it looks like when you're done. So it's windy AF on and off and I'm outside getting my grill ready. It's like a race against whatever, whatever is getting ready to blow in. Got up to 66. That's winter BBQ weather. Where, where do you live? But it's dropped to 63 in only a few minutes. Move that one to feel like 59. Oh goodness. Oh goodness gracious. Please, please be safe geek outs. Um, 59 is coolish. 59 is not freezing. It's like, it's like a nice chilly fall day is 59. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I just don't know how to, I'll figure it out. It's your preferred temp? What? You're crazy.
You are crazy. I think the weather's blowing and it'll be up in the 30s soon. Yeah, probably. I think weather's blowing and it'll be, uh, I pu put on a shirt and it's fine. <laughs> but if it's a snowstorm, it'll be here without a good air flow. Really? I start to overheat at 85. And I am not warm until it is 75 degrees. <laughs> I need, it needs to be 75 for me to be warm. Or like a nice comfortable temperature. It has to be above 70 for sure. It's Fahrenheit. Yeah. Uh, Celsius, so... 30 Fahrenheit is 0 Celsius. Oh, 32 Fahrenheit is 0 Celsius. So. It does. It is pretty cold. Hello, Fofos. Hello, Marcus. And then I, yay. Also, maybe highlight on the edges of the light circle. Yeah. I think I'll probably be doing that. I like to pretend they're talking in Celsius and they're just really damn tough. <laughs> Morgan, welcome to the stream! We missed you! I can't cope with these strange Fahrenheit scales. <laughs> Understand. Are, they, are these temperatures in Kelvin, friends? Or in Celsius? Um, these temperatures are in Fahrenheit! Southern Colorado. Gotcha. Good to know. I knew you lived in Colorado, but I wasn't sure, like, where. Colorado's kind of big. So, uh, I guess, like, since we're about 18 degrees. Maybe? I, I'm sorry. I, I feel bad because I don't know anything about Celsius. I just know that 0 and 32 are the same. So like, when we say it is below 0 here, that's literally, that means that it's literally below 0, not on Celsius, but in Fahrenheit. That's literally like, so freezing is 32. Freezing is 32. And then if, uh, and when it gets down to 0, and we say below 0, that's like, cold as anything. She's not afraid of deep nest. What? Did you smack the magic bug? <laughs> yeah, I heard uh how is uh Hollow Knight going for you? It's very very cold. It is. And it's a pretty regular thing here in Minnesota. I know, go outside no matter the season. <laughs> well, when Americans talk about temperature, everyone else thinks we're living on the sun. I mean, not, you're not wrong.
says, please stream a Hollow Knight speedrun. I'd love to watch it. It would be really fun to watch. Much of America is much harder than where I'm from. Yeah, a lot of America is probably much harder than where you're from. Not here, though. <laughs> it is. It is, um, we're very close in heat, probably. <laughs> I'm very well you are, it's about 838 Fahrenheit here. Hmm. It is, I think today, probably um, in like the 20s, it's like 20 Fahrenheit here. We'll be like, so and so temperature is freezing. And then you find out they live in Texas and they're freezing as you're melting. <laughs> exactly. I think snowed Monday night. Might be gonna do some room for a webcam. It's the best way to make a computer website. Oh, yay. That'd be a great idea. It was mid upper 60s and then the wind showed up. Well, what can you do? What can you do when the wind shows up? Um, I always demand to search when I find the city just to make to mark the pride of to to get to the mark of pride sooner. Hmm. Yeah, I would super watch that. Uh, what? That's code. We Brits are not tough. <laughs> yeah. Um, fun fact. I'm all about the fun facts today. Um, Minnesota, the Minnesota, like, temperatures, like, scale and, like, weather patterns is the same temperature and weather patterns scale as, uh, Siberian Russia. Fun fact. At least I think that I think at least I think it's true. I'm pretty sure it's true. We get quite cold here. Do not fuck with Midwestern winters. Nope. I mean, it's because, just like Siberia and Russia, it's like we're in the middle of the continent with, like, we are, like, next to a large body of water, but it is technically an inland lake. Um, so. So it is kind of the size of, like, a sea, but. A 
think it's quite cold here. <laughs> and yet still, my preferred temperature range is within the, um, oh my gosh! <laughs> Gina, hello, welcome to the stream! I'm glad you were able to catch this. Welcome to the stream. This is what I have so far. It is wonderful to see you. I'm currently doing the, um, the highlights. And we're kind of talking about, uh, the cold and whether or not it is, um, uh, what what Midwestern winters are like versus um, where everyone else is from. Because we have a very international audience today. <laughs> Everyone's like super excited that you're here, Gina. As am I. Wow. Since you are here, I uh, thought I would show you something else that I created earlier in the stream. Oh my gosh! Haku, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Gina! That is so sweet! And Gina, welcome to the brigade! You have wings now! And you can honk whenever you want! Oh my gosh, Mom! Mom, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Crags! That is so sweet! Crags, welcome to the brigade! All right, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna show you this. I made this earlier. <laughs> I thought I thought it would do uh, ju uh do uh run justice. <laughs> yes, the Ashimot is one of my cats. That is true. I have my cat. I've got the Honkamote. I've got uh, um, the thumbs up. It's called knife knuckles because my uh, brother has really like inset knuckles and they look like you could get stabbed. And I have the overlord emote. Yes, anyway. <laughs> I thought this would be fun. I'm planning on making it a sticker. One of these days. <laughs> Yay! Everyone's just like spamming emotes now. Sweet kitty. I know, right? Oh, I actually did a drawing of her earlier. Um Here's a very quick here's a very, very quick drawing of um Ash that I did earlier because um someone uh deemed very deep knuckle action, yes. Um, because someone redeemed some of my uh, fairy dust points. My parents are freaking out downstairs. <laughs> they're, they're like, oh my gosh, Jean is here. <laughs> oh, my music stopped. Nope, nope, we're good. It was just a very long pause. <laughs> you got... I would buy that sticker. Oh, good. I'm thinking of putting it on my red mobile, but I'm also definitely uh, planning on um, bringing it to any and all convention that I go to. Uh, Gina is one of the uh, cast members of Clear Skies, and this is actually her character. <laughs> I know, right? Ash is the cutest! Ash is absolutely the cutest. <laughs> Aw, thank you. Thank you, Nico, for boosting uh, Gina. She is absolutely amazing, as you have said. And made a really cool hologram character that I adore. 
and have done multiple fan arts of so far. Oh yes, we cannot forget crafting wizard. Crafting wizard for sure. Oops. <laughs> They're very happy that you said hi, mom and dad. <laughs> yep, we have the- yay! Yes, Danu Kid and the Dadanin family are my parents. If you guys didn't know that. I just want to get the coloring. Right. <laughs> we like to shower people with love here, no matter what. Killing with kindness is our motto. <laughs> Fangirl and fangirling is appropriate here. Ah, uh, you're, uh, you're fangirling. I get it. <laughs> but, yes. This was one of my favorite moments from uh, this most recent episode because I just... It was just really cool and unexpected and I liked it a lot. And everyone has already got it covered with dill and um, all that stuff. But I want to shine a moment on this because I thought it was beautiful. And also, it gives me an excuse to use really cool lighting effects. And you know me, I love lighting effects. I really hope your Kickstarter goes well, Magnus. It's gonna be really awesome. It's gonna be absolutely really cool, and I'm very excited to boost the heck out of it. Parkers, so imagine, so I imagine after I start Kick Plays, TNG will be knocked down another peg on, in my checklist if it's anywhere near a uh, shield tomorrow. Oh my gosh, shield tomorrow, shield tomorrow, and clear skies are very. It's very good. There's only three episodes of clear skies so far, and it already. I think I tweeted about this a little bit, but after watching, um, after watching the episode on VOD, and just having like what happened in this episode happen, it really felt like. It really felt like the magic of S.H.I.E.L.D. tomorrow was back, and I just, it felt like going home, for sure. I cannot recommend it enough. Salute of kindness. <laughs> Let's see if I can uh, work with this real quick. I just like the sweat. I've never drawn a character with sweat before. <laughs> Yum! <laughs> okay, let's see what I can do. No, what the heck? What you doing? I gotta go deepness. Deepness needs all my attention or I will die miserably. Uh, but I'm in Sadio Cues. Bye, everyone. <laughs>
Bye, Hate Hunt. Thank you so much for stopping by, Morgan. It's awesome always to have you. It's always, it's always awesome to have you here. I hope Deep Nest will not give you too much trouble. You have our words of encouragement. I believe in you. Bye. Our salute is honk. That's true. I was, I, I mean, I guess I can just, you know, honk. I can say it. It's not as cool as the emote. <laughs> All right, Private, you are released from duty. Actually, what if I do... Oh. I'm just trying to get it. No. No. There's gonna be a lot of finagling here. Thank you so much for cheering. I wish there was a honk cheer. I'd never stop spending money. <laughs> oh my goodness. I wish there was... Can I change what cheer... I wonder if I can change the cheer icons. I might be able to. I mean, not that I want to steal all of your money, but I can see if I can make a honk cheer. I'm sure that's something I can do. This is very difficult. I wonder if I can just erase it. Come on, step backwards. I don't know. No, don't mind me. I'm just going backwards a lot. Going backwards. Hmm. Maybe. the uninitiated i'm launching a kickstarter tomorrow yay but there's something especially off limits me otherwise i'm still yelling on twitter about it <laughs> i'm excited to hear hey that actually looks pretty good i've done it Woo! spotlight effects
That wasn't really that hard in retrospect. It was not. I just didn't know how to do it. I know, right? And I'm, it looks... Oh, I'm just so proud of this. It worked! Yes. <laughs> I, my art streams were just me trying to figure out how to do something on the fly. has herself doing a slapping out dollar bills cheer. Oh, cool. Okay, so yeah. Oh, it is for partner? Okay. Gotta get you to partner then. Well, I need an... To get to partner, I do still... I stream enough to get to partner, but I need to have an average of 75 viewers. Uh, I need to reach an average of 75 viewers. So... That's, I feel like that's a little bit of a ways off, but I admire your gumption. I think that's most art streams. Yeah, you're not wrong. gonna get there. We are gonna get there. One day, we'll get there. I mean, I got affiliate in three months, so you guys are crazy. I fully believe in your power. I'm still streaming. I just complain that I hate whatever I have, but you see it drawing at the point. Yeah. You've been overtaken by the Don and family. My and gift giving. Oh well. <laughs> I'm sure there will be plenty more. You guys have gifted a lot of subs this week. Wait, how many how how many have we gifted? Okay, so we gifted um, we started the stream with so we did two, three, four. We've done four. So that means we start with forty one, we did four We need five more subscriptions to get another emote. Oh, Gina! Oh my gosh, Gina, thanks! You are completely not obligated to, but thank you so much! That is so sweet. I... Wow. Ugh. I don't know what to do with the outpouring of love that has been happening for me recently. Like, not that it's a bad thing or at all. Like, I'm, I'm honestly so blown away and consistently humbled by it. Like, every time, um, like, this doesn't happen a lot, but it's been happening recently. Every time, like, I've been, like, you know, watching, like, streams and stuff, and every time, like, last night, this is, like, kind of like a weird tidbit, but last night when uh, Aki and uh, Jake from Q Times were playing uh, Overcooked, I was there and I was just like, I've, um, as some of you might know, I've like beat all of Overcooked with my boyfriend. That was kind of like our thing that we did for a while. Um, does Exio have a belly button? I'd assume so. But that might be a thing to consider. But, and then Aki was like, and I, I just, like, posted in chat, I was like, this is, uh, you need to do this, and Aki was like, oh my gosh, hey, Brie, and, like, basically, like, did a spiel for me on, on stream, and I was like, I'm unprepared for this level of kindness, oh my goodness, thank you. <laughs> yes, she do. Yes. And, I don't know. And then, it was, like, really sweet, like, I know this is, like, probably inconsequential, but then, on, like, the first episode of Clear Skies, uh, when Eric, like, just mentioned my name on stream about, like, the fan art that's already been pouring in, my mom, like, came, like, rushed into my room, and she was like, Brie, oh my god, you were mentioned! Oh my goodness! I was like, ah. I'm making myself blush monster, oh my goodness. Ah. You just have a lovable face. Thank you. <laughs> 
Yeah, she definitely has a belly button, I think. You're an amazingly lovable person. Aw, thank you. <laughs> I'm honestly... <bl> Asa <laughs> needs to start a this is what we mean by killing with kindness. You guys. <laughs> I just. I want to keep working, but then I'm just like. This is correct. Listen to Geek Outs. Ah! <laughs> You're the least trash person. That's so, that's a weirdly snarky, Magnus. I appreciate it. Anyways, thank you so much, Gina, for saying that you were going to, for boosting this. That is so sweet. Ugh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited for Monday, too. I'm like... It's one of it's one of the things that I look forward to the most. Being a part of being a part of the Clear Skies community is as well as like Callista Six and Chill Tomorrow and all that stuff. Being a part of this community is like absolutely amazing. Because just everyone is so nice and so supportive of everyone and it's amazing and I just I just love it. Yes, welcome new viewers! Hello new viewers! Welcome to the stream. Um, for those of you that are just joining, I am drawing Exio um, from Clear Skies, uh, uh, Gina's wonderful character who I adore very much. Um, this is weird music. I got distracted by the music. What is- this is epic instrumental music. I mean, it's cool. This is a four minute song. Cool, all right. This free YouTube playlist is pretty dang hilarious. Well, it started with a game that had no name and, it, and yet it had all of the heart. Eric's TBD RPG. Oh man, Eric's TBD RPG will forever hold a place in my heart as, like... I loved that show. It was... I still... I still say it was the best season of Doctor Who. And, I mean... Eric predicted that there was gonna be a female Doctor. And now with Aki... And now with Aki... Uh, with... Uh, Eliza? And that other A name. Ugh. With Eliza's character, and now with what was announced with the new, uh, with another doctor? Oh my goodness. Eric just knows. Eric's just psychic. He just knows. <laughs> Eric is all-knowing. Beware. Amy! Yes, Amy! Amy's amazing! Amy is absolutely amazing. Best doctor. Aw. Gina! <laughs> Thank you! I just hope that you know that every time that ever happens, I will consistently be taken off guard. No, oh, thank you, Gina. That means so much to me. I will continue to make wonderful art out of inspiration of your guys' wonderful storytelling. 
I don't know. I don't know where I would be without you guys. Seriously, I've um I decided to. Oops, wrong brush. I decided to become a freelance artist because uh of just this community and the support and just being inspired by you guys and you guys following your passions. So I don't know where I'd be without you guys and. Because the only reason I make amazing art is because you guys inspire me to, and I'm sh I'm sure that you guys get inspired by all the amazing art of the fan art community. And as we say here on this channel, is that by making art and inspiring others, it's just this wonderful snowball effect of amazing things be put out in the world, and it's just so humbling to be a part of it, no matter what. Honk. <laughs> Yay! Anyways, I'm bl I'm trying really hard to stay focused and not just blush monster so much. <laughs> I just okay. Can I just say that I honestly. Honestly, can I just say that the, um, creating the Honka mode is probably one of my uh, best achievements. <laughs> it's it's so versatile. <laughs> I know it's a joke, Magnus. I am going to be drawing you literal garbage for the SGD, so that is very true. <laughs> but I'm currently not drawing literal, dra literal garbage, I'm currently drawing a really cool hologram. <laughs> what is this music? This playlist has gotten whack, guys. This is called Free Epic Music. Alright, I think I'm gonna go find my old playlist. There we go. Back to the top. Just some nice... It is also one of the best readable word emotes on Twitch. I know, right? That was completely an accident. I had like... The reason it... I probably couldn't replicate how good it turned out. If, if you asked me to. <laughs> it was just like, I was just hanging out with you guys, making a fun emote, and it turned out absolutely spectacular. <laughs> it is absolutely spectacular. I mean, honestly, just... We gotta sing our praises to the Untitled Goose Game, because without the Untitled Goose Game, we would not be- we would not have the Honk Emote. Oh, speaking of, um, on other games- I know other games like, uh, Untitled Goose Game and Donut County. Another one that I really, really wanna play is called A Short Hike. Um, this one is a little bit less of, like, mischievous type thing, but it's another short, cute game that'd be really fun. Um, and, I don't know, I was thinking, I know, uh, Nico in, uh, our, in the Discord decide, uh, in, Nico in the Discord, um, suggested another awesome, really cool, like, 
up another game. I it is on my list of things to play, but I'm thinking of doing a short hike next as a short game. Not in the next stream. The next stream I think is Monster Crown? No, that's not it's not let me check. I think it's a uh, it might be next stream actually. Let me check. No, it's a poll game stream. So yeah. Short hike will be one of the options. But it'll be really fun, I think. There's just so many cute games. And you guys have bought me so many games. I have to honor them somehow. You said Nico is the Discord. If give me Shaka in the walls. Oh, Shaka in the walls fell. Yes, that's from um, that's from uh. Crap! What is the episode title? What is that episode title? Uh, Darmok, Darmok, right? Darmok, right? I need confirmation. Nico is the Discord. <laughs> yeah, it's Dharma. Good. Okay, cool. I was just making sure. Here's another fun fact from Bree today. Um. Uh. Darmok. Uh, the Darmok episode um, is the only full episode of Trek that I have watched. The full, like, actual legitimate full episode of Trek that I have watched. I am really, I'm a huge fan of Clear Skies, but I know nothing about Trek. Ugh. I feel like, I mean, I, I, I won't say that that's shameful, because I know Ravity does, hasn't watched much Shrek, or is just starting to watch Shrek. Shrek. Trek. Goodness. Ravity's just starting to watch Shrek. Um, no, uh, Trek. But, that is the first, um, episode that I, uh, That's true. Um, that's not true. You've watched Clear Skies. That is true. I have watched all of Clear Skies so far, as well as all of Chill Tomorrow. So I, I do think that counts. That does count as Trek, for sure. But I have not watched an actual, like, licensed Trek. I've watched one episode of a licensed Trek show. <laughs> Ugh. Star Shrek. <laughs> um, yeah, but uh, as my dad says, yes, um, I watched Darmok because that's the full up. I watched that full episode for sh um, all the way through because uh, we watched it for class. It was actually we had a whole lesson on that episode um, in my linguistic anthropology class. It was pretty cool. But yeah, I've heard. I I really want to. I it seems like something I should be devouring as well. I've heard that a lot of a, like a really good place to start for like people that. Um, I'm probably probably gonna start with either DS9 or TNG probably. But yeah. I 
I'm just really, I'm just really caught up in watching all of the amazing streamed content that so many people are make are making, and that I have, I've like, I've, I started watching Kibo. If, oh man, Miranda's not here anymore. I, sh I can't. I should have told her that earlier. But I started watching Kibo on Netflix, and um, I'm only at episode three because I've been watching streamed content the rest of the days. I feel like, I think watching Trek would be a good way to, um, spend some time not watching stream content. I mean, that definitely is how we mostly communicate in my Discord at this point, so it was fairly prophetic. <laughs> um, we just finished our TNG rewatch and just started DS9 again, and God, I love- Oh, DS9 sounds awesome. I've heard only good things about DS9. I think I've watched a, uh, oh, this is really loud, sorry. This is really loud for me, I'll turn it down a little bit. Um. Yeah, I feel like watching, just sitting down and, like, devouring Trek would be a good thing to do while I just draw. I think it'd be, I think it'd be fun. It is on my list, for sure. I've, like, I mean, I've seen a other Trek before. Like, for sure. I've seen a lot of other Trek before. But, um, not a full episode. <laughs> Mm, this is looking so good! Woo. Excuse me while I squeal at my artistic ability. Ugh. So good! But yeah, I have like, because when my parents, you know, watch it on the TV or or when other people, like, watch it. I've, like, seen bits and pieces of episodes, but never anything fully through other than Darmok. I had- I did watch, um, in middle school, I did watch a, um, an original series, um, movie. I think it was probably, like, the first one. I don't remember much about it, other than that there was, like, a satellite in it. I don't remember much about it. Um, welcome back, Dr. Panduin. Uh, Kipo was amazing. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes, Kipo, Kipo is so cool. It is a really cool, um, it's, it's so cool. I really enjoy it. I've really enjoyed watching it so far. I'm wanting to continue to watch it. It'll, it's on my list of things to continue to watch. Um, oh, please do a short spiel for Red Rook Magnus. I'd love that. Boost your stuff. This is a place for people to boost their stuff, as well as talk about whatever they want, and hang out, and watch me draw. 
We are a chill, very, we are a chill stream here. Please boost your sip. Um, the whale one, the planet, I don't, I, I, I don't know. I don't think it was the whale one. I think I would have remembered that. I, I feel like I would have remembered that. Might have been the planet one. I just remember that there was like a satellite. It was kind of boring to me, which is why I don't remember much about it. There we go. That's a good shadow. Wow. I'm proud of that. Heck yeah. Uh, after Steel Tomorrow, my favorite track is DS9. Good to know. Uh, Dub, if you still want to do that hologram effect later, I found a good way to do it. Ooh, thank you. I will look at that. So the V'ger one? It might have been the V'ger one. I do remember that when they talked about that, that in Chill of Tomorrow, it sounded familiar. So it probably was the V'ger one. That is very helpful. Thank you. I probably won't be doing that at the moment, but I am. I will definitely be implementing that later when I have when I'm not going to be experimenting live on air. I do like the lines. Did I tell you how to do the mask thing? Let me check. One second. Hmm. Okay. 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 I've got an idea. I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Okay. 
Okay, so that is an empty layer. Sweet. come across thought about Jane's real name um I thought about it I don't have a um I don't have uh an answer yet I don't know if I like that. I don't know if I like that. Sorry, I'm really I'm really focusing on these hologram effects.
I do really like that. All right, I like that. All right, sweet. This is gonna take a while. Anyone have anything cool to talk about? <laughs> this is gonna take a while. I'm think I'm I don't know for Jane's name I don't want to like give too much away, but I'm definitely thinking about it. I don't have an I don't have a um. It's true. Oh, that's just selecting the line art. <laughs> Thanks! Thanks, Gina! I'm really proud of it so far. Hi, Magnus. I'm like a Pokemon, and my name is Red Rook. Well, it is going to be a fun game no matter what. Invert selection and then remove everything outside of it. So, okay. So then that's not, that's selecting everything other than. Oh, hey, that's a great idea. I mean, it's the same thing. Okay. Oops. That didn't seem to work. didn't seem to work. <laughs> Come on, Lassie. I 
thought you were supposed to be magnetic. Okay. Uh-oh. 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 You are not helpful. That is not what we wanted. only that. That's what I thought. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, Haku. Yes, if you're interested um, in learning more about the board game that I'm working on, please uh, join the Elemental Spark Discord. Still just selecting a line art. Okay. I mean, it's supposed to be better than this. I just don't know how to make it better than this. I'm just gonna do it the way I was doing it. <laughs> just gonna do it the way I was doing it. It might be tedious, but I'm doing it. I'm gonna finish this on stream today. I'm gonna finish it. Agreed, I mean. <laughs> it is pretty cool. Thank you for... Thank you for all the reference images, Nico. This is... They were very helpful in kind of figuring out how a hologram should work. Oh, I'm thank you so much for stopping by, Gina. It was a pleasure to have you here. Um, I hope to see you in chat again soon. And um, uh, thank you for creating Exio. She's an amazing character. And I hope you have a wonderful time running errands. It was wonderful to have you. Bye. Mwah. <laughs> it's true. Uh, if ever you want to sub to Breeze cha to Breeze channel to my channel, all you have to do is talk and chat, and one of my many regulars will gift you a sub because they are crazy and super generous. <laughs> Ha!
honk, Gina. Yes, all of the honks. Uh, uh, da, 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 da. <laughs> Using Photoshop like tools to blend shit together is like one of the few things I can do that is normally artistic. Yeah, there is so many tools in Photoshop that I do not know how to use, and I will freely admit that I am in no way a Photoshop wizard. I know some hotkeys. Mainly the ones to uh, delete things and the ones to make straight lines. And that's about it. I am outing myself here as not an aficionado in the medium I choose, but hey. Whatever. There is always more to learn. I am revised, and by God, I have no idea what else I am doing. <laughs> yeah. That's what- that's all art is. It's just improvisation. We claim to know what we're doing, but we have no idea. But, if you'd like a commission from me- <laughs> I'm kidding, I know what I'm doing. In most cases. Um, writing and making games are very important artistic skills, and you should definitely not devalue those. Those are extremely important. Um, I mean, personally had to give up the full, ad full Adobe Suite because the student price ran out. Mm. When does the student price run out? Asking for a friend. <clears throat> asking for a friend. <clears throat> I pay full price. Adobe, if you're watching, I pay full price, but my friend needs to know when that runs out. Huh? <laughs> In theory, four years old. Good to know. I have until May. No, my friend has until May. Adobe, shh. 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 I saw nothing. Yes, our friend is known by all.
like I'll be paying no attention to the stream. <laughs> There, that known as that one weirdo that does everything and needs knowledge about everything. Yes, there's only one person in the world that needs knowledge like that. He just found Photoshop behind a truck and wants to return it to its rightful owners. <laughs> The lines have been completed. We've got a really cool shadow. Exio is almost done. I have a friend who got Photoshop for free on a questionable site. Remind me to make my space game sort of cyberpunky. I will. I'll remind you to do space and cyberpunk and things at night, because I'm good at those. If you want to see some other cool, like, cyberpunk art that I've done, I did art for Callisto 6, which was a cyberpunk RPG that I'm super excited about. That uh, was amazing, and that uh, Gina was also a part of. I think I just gotta fix up some of these shadows, and I think this is really close to being done. The space monks are fighting a de alien demons from cyberspace. Oh my gosh, this is turn this is turning into cyber chase, and I'm here for it. And Funk being stuck like he was a demon summoned from the abyss. Yes, we were talking about cyberpunk. And that uh, Magnus would like to hire me to do uh, cyberpunk art for a game eventually. <laughs> I've done a cyberpunk art for Callisto Six, and one of the um and one of the OCs that I would uh, was wanting to draw would um her name is I can tell you about this character I think I have before, but this is what uh, Geek Guts was asking me about earlier. But I have a character named um, Jane Doe, or um as cl more colloquially known as Nobody. Um, personally, it's a fun play on um the Od Odysseus's Nobody. But it's also a fun play on the fact that this character um, never uh, shows uh, her real face, nor um, does it never, uh, never, um, never shows her real face, um, and never really like shows people who she really is, or will divulge her legitimate name. She actually completely erased her name from all records, and. Um, and ha and thus became nobody. She is basically she is a grifter basically, um, who uh, adopts these personas um, of people being um, and to con really horrible people out of money that they and give it back to their victims. Sort of leveragey, but in a cyberpunk world.
Oh, really? And number one, as uh, Avery designated her in his drone OS. That's awesome. That's cool. But yeah, um, her basic her basic look that is still not really what she looks like, um, because she has this hollow necklace where she basically like changes like she does like, you know, makeup magic as well as like uses the uh, like hologram technology to make her face look different all the time. So you can't really tell who she is, and it's almost impossible for you to recognize her. And you know, her hair can change color and all of that stuff. Um. And the hollow necklace also makes it so she, uh, can't, uh, have, so, like, surveillance cameras can't, uh, facial, do facial recognition software based on her, basically. So she is nobody, and her basic look is, like, this high, uh, ponytail that is, like, aerial color red, um, and, uh, pink eyes, but, like, basically, um, just nondescript gray and black clothing um so her head is kind of quite like her head is very um her head is very ostentatious in a way but less ostentatious than most cyberpunk people look she also has no visible cybernetics um but she has them obviously just on here. Karen Fulu, welcome to the stream! Um, so yeah, she's pretty, she's cool, and I like her a lot, and we've only played one session with her, so I can't tell you too much more about her, just because I don't know too much more about her other than those things. Um, it's awesome. She's cool, and I like her a lot. I like the name Nobody. The Spellbound Kingdoms of Constellations from Mars. Uh, so there are alien demons from cyberspace filling into filling into real space, and they're weird and glitchy and glitch out real and glitch out reality itself. So deep space monks are astral traveling out and, and doing space kung fu based on the constellations to smite back the demons. As they do, develop the nebula battle aura. They'll, they smite the demons um, with pure and purifying starfire. <laughs> it sounds that sounds really cool, Magnus. I would love to do art for that. She's the less murdery, more cyberpunk version of of a faceless man from Game of Thrones. Yes, a lot less murdery, a lot more cyberpunk griftery. Murder is not her mo. That would be the, um, that would be the OC that I would be drawing on stream. Just tiny murder. What's life without a little murder? Just a tiny murder. Just a wee bit of murder. Nothing too bad. Just a wee bit of murder.
I just killed a man for no reason. <laughs> I feel like that's like a very dopey god monster. <laughs> that's very ant. That's very like cute anime girl villain though, which are arguably the most terrifying uh, villains that there are, because they're so cute. It's horrifying. Don't mind me, just drawing some wood. I'd write her. <laughs> There we go. One song about the joys of murder and mayhem. Uh, her, her, her. <laughs> you guys! Look at that! I think Exio is done! It looks so good! Man, that light- I am so glad I found that gradient tool. It looks so good! Looks so good. So gosh dang proud of it. Oh my gosh. Why the laugh was your reaction? <laughs> Thank you, Harriet. It's a good it's a good one. Oh, look at all those ash emotes. Thank you guys. Happy artist person is happy. I am happy. I'm extremely happy. Oh, thank you guys. I'm so happy about this. Oh my gosh. Whew. Man, that spotlight effect is phenomenal. The spotlight effect is absolutely phenomenal. I'm so proud of it. Okay. Okay. I know I'm I'm really high. Ooh, all right. We have went a little bit over time um, today, but that is totally okay. It's only 30 minutes, and I'm actually really proud with the amount of art that we managed to get done today. 2K and I make you draw more stuff. I'm looking forward to it. Yay! I'm looking forward to it, too. It was actually really fun. 
And then the program crashes. No, I already saved it. It's fine. But uh, we drew this. We drew this cute kitty thanks to Magnus today. We drew this good, good space goblin because of um, um, this good, good space goblin because of Basilisk. Um, thank you guys so much for uh, uh, turning in your fairy dust, and in exchange got these really, really. <laughs> um, exchange got the got these really cute little quick drawings, fifteen to twenty minutes, twenty minutes really. Um, I'm honestly really happy with this. I think I'm gonna like. I said that about a lot of things that I've made on the stream, and I am planning on doing it. I am planning on cleaning things up and posting them for sure. Um, but I might not. Ha I might just post this as is. You know, the messiness is part of its charm. <laughs> what if someone was to fairy dust purchase a doodle? <laughs> Right now, I would have to go to the bathroom again. <laughs> but I will be doing more art things, so you guys just keep getting those points. And I will be doing more art things very soon, on Saturday. I ha We have... Well, let me check my schedule real quick. Um... Um, I am streaming on, uh, the, I'm streaming one more art stream this month on the 8th. So next, um, next week will be our final regularly scheduled, I'm shaving points for a Jane bust. Ooh, that'll be really cool. I'm excited for that. Um, but yeah, I'm, our regularly scheduled art stream is going to be on Saturday and then the next three Saturdays that month is going to be no stream because of conventions and things. When do you pose for poll games? Usually it's, I've been doing it the day before, um, but usually I've been doing it the day before. I will also uh, make sure to post those polls in Discord. I did not do it this time, but I'll do it. I'll, I did not do it for this uh, stream, but I'll do it next time. Oh, that is so sweet to hear. Tell your mom that I think that she's cool. I usually, yeah, I usually do it the day before. So I think, um, I'm going to be putting a short hike on, uh, as a one and also a few others. I don't quite remember off, off the top of my head what I was planning on doing. But we're going to be doing a lot more gaming streams this uh, uh, month just because that's how uh, my schedule happened. Um, but I will be doing a lot more. I'll be doing makeup art streams, possibly on Fridays and Sundays. Those are just the days that I'm more free. Um, so we'll see. We'll see what um, I'm able to do. But we're going to be doing makeup art streams for sure because I love to, part of this channel is all about drawing. I do games because it's fun and I want to hang out with you guys and you know, do that type of thing, but, Alex T. Blue, hi, welcome to the stream, uh, Monster Prom, Monster Prom, I'm gonna be doing, uh, the day before, uh, Valentine's Day, as it should be, hello, Alex T. Blue, welcome to the stream, we still haven't had our multiplayer session, we can do that on, uh, February 13th, we should definitely do that, How are you doing, Alex T. Blue? It's, we're towards the end of the session, uh, uh, end of the stream, because I finished, uh, the Exio dance art that I, uh, started. I, um, I'm extremely proud of it. I'm so excited. I'm just so... <laughs> I leave that to you, fuck. <laughs> I'm so proud of it. Yes. And thank you. Oh, I was gonna do my spiel. Thank you, Haku, for the reminder. Um, I am, for those of you that don't know, my name is Bree. I am a comic artist and illustrator. 
Um, I'm currently working on Chapter 2 of my comic, The Phoenix, which you can find on Tapas and Webtoon, as well as my website. I also work on a board game called Elemental Spark. If you would like to learn more, we are at Sheba Blaze on Twitter. Oh, thank you, Alex T. Blue. That is so sweet. I'm hyped for Tuesday. I'm also hyped for Tuesday. It is nice to have you. Um, I'm doing I'm doing well, Alex T. Blue. I'm really excited because I just finished this and it's so cool. But I'm also extremely hungry. <laughs> This art is great, and many other fabulous synonyms. It looks so cool! Man, the- that- I'm so glad I found that gradient tool. It looks... choice. Thank you so much, Happy, for that link. Um, but yes, um... Uh, I do- um, I also, as you might no notice, I do a lot of fan art for Clear Skies. Um, and if you'd like to, uh, you know, it's ES Discord. ES Twitter. You guys, here you go. Hey, why is it not working? That's weird. I have to pause my spiel real quick. Did Nightbot decide to die? Guys, I think Notbot's dead. I think Nightbot is completely perished. <laughs> Nightbot died, everybody. Oh no. Oh my gosh. F in chat for Nightbot. <laughs> oh gosh. Our trusty Nightbot. <laughs> oh no! Who killed Nightbot? Oh well, let him take. O let me take over. I I trust you, uh, Haku, the next pre mystery. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone! Please consider following. Haku is just has killed Nightbot and taken taken Nightbot Nightbite <laughs> Nightbite Nightbot's place. I will continue my spiel. Spiel. Um. Man, that's hilarious. That is absolutely hilarious. Um. I do clear guys fan art. If you'd like to, um, you know, know more about what I do or see a lot of art that I do, please uh, consider joining um the uh, our Discord. Um. We, um, we here in the brigade have a discord. Um, nope, Nightbot's dead. I, we can't do the link to discord, because Nightbot is fully dead. One second. <laughs> Oh my gosh! I was trying to find a link. Oh my gosh! Alex T. Blue, thank you so much for following! Welcome to the brigade! Thank you so much, Haku, for the link. It was, it was Haku in the attic with the candlestick. Here is a link to the Discord, if you are interested. Um, you have the link in your panels, right? Eh, <laughs> I do not. Do I have it? I might, I'm not sure, actually. I have where you can find my Redbubble, my Twitter, my website, my Instagram, my comic, but that's it. I don't have, oh, and my coffee, and my tip jar. <laughs> Oh my goodness. You do like following. Welcome to the brigade. Yes, thank you so much, Alex T. Blue. 
of his, but I'm trying to uh, highlight the announcements. <laughs> All right. Um, but uh, that's that's who I am. If you like uh, sci-fi fantasy, uh, sci-fi uh, adventure comics, I the Phoenix is what that is. I don't. I do not. I should probably fix that just in case this happens ever again. Oh, yes. Also, thank you, Haku, for reminding me, new Nightbot. Um, I also do commissions. If you are interested in um, commissioning me for any type of artwork, um, generally character commissions or cover illustrations, uh, you can find a link to my commissions in my Twitter, which, uh, on, in my Twitter, on my Twitter, um, which there is a link below. There really is one, I promise. Um, so it is my pinned tweet, so it'll be super easy to find. I'm glad you could catch too. Sorry, this is towards the end of the stream, but I'm glad that you are here. Thank you, Haku. Um, let's see. Was there anyone we could go? We could go raid. Uh, go J. Go J. G. Or, but yeah. This is uh, this is the end of the stream. Uh, just I have to eat dinner now. And we went a little long, but thank you, Alex T. Blue, for being here. Thank you so much, Hair, uh, Hair Thulu. Thank you so much, Basilisk. Thanks so much, Haku, Magnus, Japandwin, Geek Outs, um, Gina earlier, um, I think, uh, Mom, Dad, my brother, um, uh, Hate Hunt earlier. All of these wonderful, for, on wonderful people. Fern was here earlier. I showed up when I could. I know you could. And it's, no matter when you come in, it's always awesome to, to have you. We could do, we could go raid sh shle Shells and Doodles. Who is Shells and Doodles? I will look them up. On the Twitter with them tweets. Oh, thank you so much, Haku. I also have a coffee if you are interested in supporting me. I love that my chat is just trying really hard to become Nightbot for me. I appreciate you all. I would like to thank the Academy. Yes. Alright. Um, let's find out. Hey, Alex T. Blue, welcome to the stream. I mean, welcome to the Discord. Blah. I need to rest. She always has great music on her stream. There's no more, there's no more music anymore. It's gone. It has also died. Um, I'm gonna find, uh, okay, so, oh, you're talking about Shells E. Doodles. Shells. Shells. Shells Ed. Shells Ed Doodles. Oh, yeah, sure. This looks like a fun game. This looks like a fun, uh, stream to raid. I will do so. Thank you for being, thank you for being awesome, Alex T. Blue. You bring your awesome, go get dinner. Alright, I'll go get dinner. We'll raid, uh, Shells D. Doodles. Uh. <laughs> you are Nightbot number two, for sure. Yes, we are, we will be more than happy to have you around more often. Haku does have a special role on Discord, I'm pretty sure. Um, one second. Let's find, let's remember how to raid, as always. Okay. Oh, that's a word. <laughs> We can talk about all in uh, all in Discord real quick, but we're gonna go ra raid another wonderful artist and hopefully make a new friend. Um, I will see you guys all on Thursday when we play another fun game together. I don't know what it is yet, but we will find out. Incident. Um. Oh, thank you, thank you so much, Haku, for the direct link. Um. All right. Slash raid channel name. All right. Thank you. All right. Bye, everybody. It was awesome to have you. Thank you so much all for being here, and I will see you all on Thursday. Bye! Mwah. Ready to raid in 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2,
one. Bye.